Steve Ribbit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get him in the air. Look, I got Steve all in the air. Why is he ribbiting? But it's Steve and Laura time. Let's go. <laughs> oh gosh. Steve Ribbit, stop that. <laughs> Steve finds all these different ways to. <laughs> he finds all these creative ways. You gotta give the boy props. He finds creative ways to. To annoy his lord, this boy is in a frog suit. But I, 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 want to, I want to point out, I think it's so cute. Look, she got her little princess, you know, uh, thing on her head. And he, look, he got a, he might be a frog, but he got that, that king thing on it. Uh, what is it? The crown. I just, I just like that. They're just so cute. And I'm wondering, where did they come from? For just all the people that are like, oh, she don't like Steve, and she's embarrassed to be around Steve. It looks like they possibly came from the same place, don't you think? Okay. Let's make the fairy tale come true. Kiss this homely frog and turn him into a handsome prince. I am not kissing a frog. Oh, come on. How about a horny coat? <laughs> Steven, look, it doesn't matter what he has on. You know what I'm saying? It does not matter. Lord, give me some. Give me some luscious, okay? Oh, my goodness gracious, Steve. <sighs> <laughs> that's not that's not Richie. <laughs> me. Yeah. Who are you? Wait. <laughs> Wait a minute, Laura said. <laughs> Laura said, "Excuse me. <laughs> Who are you, Laura? This is the baby. You, the baby might be scared." She said, "Excuse me. <laughs> Why are you here? Who are you? I need some identification because you're not Richie. Oh gosh. Funny Oh." I do remember a woman with a small kid dressed like Spider Man. Mm. There was something different about her. <laughs> Might she have been Chinese? <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, I love when Steve, I love when he actually gets mad. But I'm putting this in here because this really has nothing to do with, with Steve and Laura's. Well, it does because they're in the same, but not really a, a storyline of them. But I like it because it's kind of like Laura's kind of letting Steve kind of deal with things. I like that she does that. <laughs> this is Tommy. You see, Waldo left with Richie, but he came back with Tommy. Uh-huh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. Where, where's Richie? <laughs> That's what <laughs> I'm telling you, I love when Steve. <laughs> I love when Steve gets frustrated. Oh my gosh, I love when he gets frustrated. But again, I, I'm I'm just putting this in here because I'm I'm like I said before, I'm just loving how Laura is just letting him handle this stuff. You know what I'm saying? Whoa, chill. <laughs> Oh, so we gotta think that. <laughs> <laughs> Stop thinking, Waldo. You'll hurt yourself. <laughs> Steve, Steve taking shots. Laura's just letting Steve go in on everybody. <laughs> Laura's just letting Steve go in on everybody. Eddie, Waldo. <laughs> okay, we'll just put the mask back on Tommy, and the first chance we get, we'll go back out and look for Richie. Mm -hmm. okay? Finally, a voice of reason. A little roll in her eyes. Probably because of that. <laughs> oh, gosh. Steve, what have you done now? What have you done, Steve? Okay, Laura walking in, rolling her eyes at you, boy. Wait. <laughs> uh, that was a fun date. Uh, <laughs> Come on, Steve. It wasn't a date. Uh, oh, no. I went to the movie alone, uh. and you sat down next to me right after it started. <laughs> And you didn't dump your soda all over me. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. I'm wearing you down. I'm wearing you down. <laughs> I'm wearing you down. <laughs> look, Steve, look. Come on now. Real love is not easy, right? You just got to keep moving forward. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Look at Laura. <laughs> look at Laura. <laughs> she doesn't have a response. She just looks. <laughs> Oh god. Let's get comfortable. <laughs> Eddie's all smooth with it. Uh huh. Oh gosh. Steve. Hey, baby. Uh, oh gosh. Steve. <laughs> Steve. Oh, let's get comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Man, he's straight.
the hip hop parade right onto Lauren's lap. <laughs> Steve, she's supposed to be on your lap. You don't, you don't hip hop parade yourself under her lap. Come on now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look, he's getting his cues from Steve. Steve, no. Steve, no. No, Steve. <laughs> Steve smile, he boy, he is in seventh heaven, baby, huh? He is that close to Lord to amount to everything, all parts of our body right now. Oh gosh, just just let that marinate for a second. <laughs> <laughs> when it all it all falls down, <laughs> Steve, when it all falls down. But look, I'm loving this shirt that Lord has on with the the mixture with the sweater with the. I'm thinking it has like the long sleeves with the hoodie. Yeah, I, I, it's dope. It's dope. Come on, dude. Come through, Kelly, with the fashion. Come on now. Mm -hmm. Steve Urkel, you mm -hmm. are the most annoying human being I've ever met. <laughs> <laughs> you heard her. Uh huh. Your we did. witnesses. Yeah. She used the phrase human being. Uh huh. Steven, she didn't even ask you to leave either, bro. She didn't even ask you to leave, right? She just went into the kitchen knowing you're going to follow her. Come on now. Come on now. Uh huh. He uh-huh, go get us there, for real, huh, for real. She didn't tell you to leave. You know, you can look at from this is you hear people say all the time, you know, Laura need to, you know, recognize what she got and blah, 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 and stop doing that to Steve. And like, the, it, it, that irritates me so bad because the reality of it is neither one of them are ready right now. Steve is not ready. Laura's not ready. Prime example in front of your camera. Okay. Like I said, it's just so cute and everything. You want to sn snuggle up with somebody, get my little snuggles in or something. But you know, the, you see how he is and this is just friendship. Can you imagine how Steve would be if they were dating? He would not let Laura breathe, right? So that's where Steve needs to, where he would need to grow to be able to, you know, direct his passion and his, and his love for her, you know, in a way that is, um, in, in a way that is positive and that benefits both of them, you know, and Laura on her side, you know, she does need to learn how to really be loved like that and to be treated like royalty the way that Steve treats her. And, and to be able to love that way as well. But they're, neither one of them are ready. And, and, you know, and this is not the harvest still in what we see in front of us. This is still seed form right now. This is not, you know, the harvest. Um, the harvest is not ready. He's still, you know, sowing seeds and they're still building, right? They're still building. Laura's still learning stuff about Steve and herself. Steve is still is learning stuff about uh, um, himself. And learning stuff about Laura and, you know, learn how to cultivate each other, learn how to make it through these things. So, you know, I think that's what we need to understand, man. That's why the Bible says seed, time, and harvest. Y'all want Steve to go get his harvest when his harvest is not ready. Y'all want Laura to be on, on on board and the harvest is not ready. This is still seed form right now. So, yeah, man, I love God, love people. May God bless you. May God keep you.